As James Gunn is busy building his own DCU, original Wonder Woman Linda Carter is making some bold remarks about the character's future. Welcome to Stats In. If you're just joining us, please subscribe and don't forget to turn on notifications bell for more videos. Gal Gadot may have replaced Linda Carter as the iconic superhero Wonder Woman, but Carter will forever be remembered for the role. Known for this role as well as championing several crucial causes, the actress and singer returns to DC soil in Wonder Woman 2. Needless to say, fans were happy to have her around, even though it was Gadot who wore the lasso of truth. He is scheduled to appear in a third part as well, and the trio has long been dead. And while there's no news about the character in DC's version of James Gunn, Carter has made some bold claims about Diana Prince that James Gunn should address soon to avoid any controversy. Linda Carter starred as the DC superhero from 1976 to 1979. It was her charismatic portrayal that made the character popular. While Gal Gadot took over for years in Zack Snyder's DCEU, Carter returned as the Warrior Asteria in Wonder Woman 1984 and was also slated to be part of the threesome. After much anticipation and rumors, Gadot's threequel has been dead since 2020, though James Gunn apparently promised Gadot that it would one day be brought back, see Variety. And now while speaking with Yahoo Entertainment, the former Diana Prince stated the following about Wonder Woman's fate in the DCU. Even Betty Jenkins, the director of both Wonder Woman films, appears to have made similar claims in an old X post and more recently while on the Talking Pictures podcast. While DC's new president, James Gunn, has not made any comments about Jenkins or Carter's comments, he should soon avoid any potential controversy regarding the character or his inclusion within the DCU. Linda Carter described Wonder Woman as a fan-favorite character and that the films starring Gal Gadot were a great franchise. While it's true that the character is very likable and fans have expressed their appreciation for Gadot's portrayal, the sequel, Wonder Woman 1984, was a much-panned feature, see Rotten Tomatoes. Thus, after Carter's comments went viral, fans, contrary to what Carter would have wanted, seemed uninterested in the series or the now-canceled trilogy. Okay, that's it for this episode. 